start of the 21st century, there are two MMOs that were popular at school during my time as an 8th and 9th grader. These two MMOs were Tibia and Red Moon. Tibia, I'm sure that most of the viewers of this video would have at least heard of the game, but Red Moon, not so much. Even its TV tropes page is blank. Red Moon is based off the Korean manhwa of the same name by Huang Mina. Six of the 18 volumes was localized here in the United States by Comics One. As a note of that, it was one of the first Korean manhwa localized here in the United States. Unfortunately, the publishers have since went defunct and I have yet to find any fan-made scanlations. So if there's any Korean manhwa scanlators watching this video, please consider this series as a future project, or even better, tell me that you or somebody else is working on it already. The Red Moon Manhwa itself is an epic sci-fi fantasy story of love and war of human and aliens. Tae Young, known as Filler, is an average high school student, but from one day he starts getting attacked by mysterious enemies and saved by even more mysterious allies. Red Moon Online suffered a similar fate as its Manhwa counterpart stateside. Its official server has since been shut down. Because of this, this Let's Play will be played on the private server Red Moon Classic. Population 47. In its heyday, one would pay a $10 a month subscription fee for an account capable of holding three characters. If my memory from what I read was correct, a major factor for this game's public server's downfall was its hacking instance, but a lack of interest could perhaps be its true reason as well. Red Moon plays similar to the original Diablo. A player fights mobs like gangsters, spies, and cyborgs by repeatedly clicking on them and using attack skills. When they level up, they pump points into stats. One of the more noticeable clerks about this game is how players are able to gain absurdly high levels of experience. Early game content can last from level 1 to 200, with end game player levels exceeding 1000. Like most early MMOs, Dying can be painful as one might drop an item and by the time that person returns, his or her item might be already claimed by someone else. With that out of the way, let's begin playing the game itself. So yes, always go to the beginner's zone, even if you're not a beginner. I'll show you why. And, let's see. And you always use your click bar. And apparently I have to... But for now, we're going to use Psychic, sh psychic Shock as our, and the Suicide Sun as our two skills. These characters are the actual characters themselves, I guess if you listen to them they give you hints about the backstory. Light hits about the game itself. And there's a store over, which gives you a second street map. But the thing is, we already have a second street map, so this makes that store over completely useless. So here's where we get the whole bunch of guys. Now, normally this would be suicide, but considering that you can't really die here unless you absolutely try, you can hit on, on you all you want and you're pretty much like uh, just going to laugh. So, in the hot cage, you press right key to use a skill. Or you can press shift, right key, and use your special technique. Since you're still hitting on you, special technique. And you'll. See that type of ownership in a while. It almost sounds like those hooligans are safe. Are, are calling me a name. Since I'm trying to make this family friendly, use your imagination. This character, instructions indicate that you build up. Let's see. Yeah, spirit. Which I think is this one. Okay. Yeah. Yep. 
double click to pick up items apparently of Mike. What Mike be, what many people could probably consider it's contemporary rock rock rock. But yeah, you can't get it go any farther than level 3 in this area. And with that, um, we'll move on to our next character. This is another one of my 15 characters. This guy's Avonhilt. Uh, um, Avonhilt plays a Sadat character. I guess that's like... The actor name is Avid Hill, the character name is Sadat, I guess. Which, if I remember from the, um, from what I re remember from the first volume of Red Moon, means nothing, I guess. So, first we'll, um, get some equipment for this guy. Go first by his um, oak sword. And then t shirt. Some leather pants. Baseball cap. Parallel boots. And though this guy, being only a level 3, has mastered the art of wearing gloves, a pair of gloves. I know, I think VG Cats made a joke of this one to know. I think it was using Final Fantasy 12 as a reference, either that or 11. I haven't really gone in depth with either of those games, so I don't quite sure. Oh yeah, does has a master of the art of wearing gloves. That's right. Like on these settings for this game, I can't can't record any more than hopefully 15 minutes, or otherwise Cam Studio will throw a hissy fit. Layman's terms just does says can't record your can't save your file. Sorry, that's Cam for that's Cam Studio throwing a hissy fit for you. So I might either just cut this video and then, um, then record another part of the video and then combine this on the video. I'm sure you'll probably be able to tell 
where the edit is, is whenever I start to fade out and fade back in. That'll be the, that'll be the main transition. So... Really haven't really gone, gone to the crowds yet, but... should do stuff like this where you're able to fight crowds at the very beginning of the game. But hopefully I'll get to those crowds. One such crowd. Oh, oh, spy, spy. Scarum, I guess, or I said Soul Play. Okay, I'll hit him the rest of the way. Okay, Evans, Dex, okay. On his drink, Evans, Dex. Oh, 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 oh,
Conventional wisdoms would say that this is suicide right here, but... Yeah, even if you this is suicide. It is suicide. But if I was only able to, um... Only able to press shift and right-click when I needed to. Okay, I'm still going to throw this effect now, so I guess I'll 
transition. And we're about to record 10 more minutes before I'm going to switch to another character. You'll probably still see this on one video, this, this video, this and another character. This is going to be an almost 60 minute video, pilot videos. But yeah, always remember. Let's see. Yeah, the short key mode is still on. I guess it only turns off when you exit the game. So yeah, Black Dying is actually a pretty good deal. Let's 
is the dog seeking to fight good crowds. I guess this will do. <laughs> studio settings. to this character will show him upgrade his equipment, but... For now, let's just switch to, um, another character. Well, 
right after we find out where that shop is. So how many levels is that? I guess that was eight levels in the course of 25 minutes. Congratulations to me. Oh yeah, that's right. Meet my filler character, named by username Van Caddix. And he is a level 14 with the following stats right here. And he is about to go spy hunt. And he's about to be his yeah. He's about ready to go spy hunting. So with beer, beer with a whole bunch of beer, he's guessing he's going on a drunken spy hunt. Because beer heals me, heals um, I guess mana. I don't know, probably not mana. <laughs> Spies right now. That's Soul Spirit. And we gotta. Oh, hold on. Okay. Oh, that's right, I forgot the hold. the river so there. there's quite a few spies right now so Short key mode on. Yep, it's short key mode on. I always really forget if it's quick key or short key. And another level up. I think we'll just invest in spirit for now. Let's see if I can one shot these spies yet. Well, I was that time. Let's try that again. Wow, one shot in disguise. It's official. Oh, another spear. Okay. Have some of my soul spear. But it looks like not even beer is refilling all my mana. 
has, so... He needs a stiffer drink. <laughs> third out this year. Just okay. So what did you want? All right. Silk so pants one has been attained. Okay. Every little bit helps.
looks like we got a crowd. You know what? We'll, we'll play it on. Buy the next Deathless drink. range of the store areas. Bye, 
our shared drinks. Okay, so what do you have past? Okay, fine. Alright. We have 280 gold, that means we can... Let's see. Oh, we could use the white tin for now, so that takes us. Let's try out the next area now. Before that. for a lower level character, but we're just a high level character, and let's see if this takes us anywhere. Apparently not. I'm trying to find the next route. And so right, right now, these guys all around here are just nuisances. Trying to go for negative honor here since so.
that great area. here that can freeze you for longer and a little bit stronger. Okay, that seemed to um, take away some of all right there, but not Okay, that guy does take a few hits. And if I remember, do not let him get close to you.
let's see. There you have it. This is the this will probably mark close to the end of the um of the pilot episode of this let's play. I'm not sure if it'll continue. Probably depends on probably still play this game still, but I'm not sure if it'll continue since this Cam Studio and all these programs since we're messing up, up on me, but... Oops. Heal, heal. Okay, back up a little bit. And heal up some. Well, we're about out of time, so see you next video.